<laughs> this is a tough one. Okay. It's basically a video game about politicians, and that's what we wanted to do, to create a video game that would have these characters in, and they would fight in a video game, not only for entertainment, because to be honest, we, we do enjoy having politicians fight against each other, but we wanted a video game that would also enable us not only have the entertainment bit, but also the educational bit. So that's how No Coach 2017 came about. And do you? Wow, uh, nice. This generation is the one that is going to take over the mantle from the previous one. So you know how you, you never teach an old dog new tricks, there's that saying. So how about we focus on the puppies? So we teach them what they need to know for the future, to mend what has been uh, messed up in the previous, uh, by the previous generation and to also do better things for the betterment of society. So I think we're doing that by educating the youth. By getting the youth to play the game and telling them about peace, we are completely neutralizing the youth to not be biased and to give them that knowledge that they are in control, do not get incited. And also a message of civic education, because that's really important. We need to know how to vote, when to vote, why to vote, and who to vote for. Sometimes you play Rayla wins, sometimes you play uh, Uhuru wins. So either way the game continues, uh, same way you, you know, when you play it in the game, in real life, it means whoever loses or wins, uh, Kenya still continues.